Hey guys, I'm back with another video, and, and uh, yeah, look, I know that this morning's video was interesting at best. Yeah, it's too bad the dog's not here yet. But, yeah, but, yeah, but hey, at least you guys got the chance to see her in action torturing her little stuffed animals. <laughs> yeah, and... And Jacob Gutierrez, I give you my condolences. It's a shame when uh, someone or something you care about actually dies. And I mean something isn't like an animal, really. Like a living, breathing animal that you care about. Yeah. Yeah, so I guess if you name it, it I guess it still counts as a someone, really. But yeah, anyway, look, the point is, it's really shitty when that happens. I've already lost so many people in my life. Hell, one of them was some dude who was apparently my mother's brother who I barely knew. Now, I only saw him, like, once. That was it. Like, one time. Out side of his own damn house. Hell, I was even too afraid to go into that damn house because he had these big ass dogs. I believe it or not, I'm slightly afraid of large dogs because I'm scared they're gonna tear the shit out of me. Okay, so that's enough cussing for me. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, I still have plans for, for the next video. I'm actually going to try and get more sleep tonight. Because let's be honest, that shirt... Let's be honest, that shirt nap, pretty much. God damn, I was actually listening to a story and hoping to God it would help me fall asleep, regardless of what it was. Sure, I was laughing during the story. But, dude, even funny stories have a chance of, well, putting you to sleep anyway. Sure, you'll be laughing in your sleep, but still. I mean, hey, it happened to me, and if it happened to me, it can happen to anyone. I mean, you don't know. Alright, so yeah, I have an update for the, um, for the, um, second album, I guess. Uh, yeah, look, my friend will be back tomorrow, I think, since today is... Uh, oh, wait, yeah, yeah, my friend will be... My friend will be back tomorrow. Hopefully I can make a new video with her, and maybe we can actually, like, get more song ideas down or something. I mean, hell, it would be really fun, and it would also give me a lot more options to choose from for the next song to write. I mean, Crack Like a Mirror isn't really ready for the audience's ears yet. But yeah, I still have to figure out, like, the overall melody and the pitch that I should sing at for that to work. But I've got the lyrics down. Uh, oh, sorry, sorry. Jesus, I'm so tired. But I'm honestly gonna make this at least a 10 minute video for you guys. So, yeah, basically, yeah, yeah, my, my mother left with her dog, and those two are still at work, apparently. I haven't even, I haven't even spoken to anyone yet, but I don't know if I will, actually. I mean, assuming that I will basically uh, lose access to my phone at some point. Because of some auto-enroll well, payment thing on my phone. Yeah, it just said I was de-enrolled last time I checked, and I don't know if that's going to have any effect on my phone, or if I can use my phone at all. 
yeah. And honest to God, like, my overall choice when it comes to the racism is basically to just abandon you now. Yeah, like, abandon the platform called you now. And, uh, I'm sticking to YouTube. Stuck to YouTube for life, yo. Sorry, sorry. Like, I know that was cringy. Like, I was trying to do a church impression from Red vs. Blue, in case you haven't seen that. I highly recommend you check it out. It's actually a pretty damn good show. They just got done with their, their 17th season back in May. Yeah, it was already, like, almost three full months since the end of season 17, pretty much. Yeah, a lot of shit's gonna go down soon. But hey, I'm actually really excited for Ruby. Well, Ruby Volume 7 if they ever get around to the damn thing. But of course, uh, I'm gonna ask my friend if she is still planning on and, uh, basically getting a first membership, which I wouldn't recommend it because of Rooster Teeth's stupid-ass decisions. Look, I know I said I wasn't gonna cuss again. This'll be it. I swear to God, this'll be it. Yeah, because of Rooster Teeth's dumb decisions, and, uh, and the fact that they have no respect for their fans, critics, and, well, others who actually just want to help, and they just want to help they just want to see them succeed, you know? Yeah, it's really messed up. Like, I mean, hell, Rooster Teeth isn't even the first company, like, the first billion-dollar company, pretty much, to basically screw someone over. Oh, because believe it or not, Nickelodeon deliberately waited for Steven Hillenberg the creator of Spongebob, to die before they decided to go through with any spin-offs and shit, despite the fact that he basically he said in one of his rules that no spin-offs of Spongebob were allowed. That proves how greedy and money-hungry companies are. Okay, I don't know how the... Okay, I don't know how I got... It from, well, basically YouTube to uh, businesses, actually. Uh, oh, sh oh, shoot. I was just distracted. Ah, uh, screw it. Ah, uh, screw it. Yeah, I'm still excited for er, Red vs. Blue Season 18 and uh, Ruby Volume 7, pretty much. And to think, Ruby Volume 7 will be in November this year. Yeah, my friend told me this on a walk to come and go. Yeah, that is exactly where and when I found this out. Well, I've got a lot I can look forward to, actually. Um, yeah, pretty much. Yeah, I'm still working on and at the end of the... The first story arc in uh, season one. So yeah, that'll be coming up very soon. And to be honest, I'm actually really excited for, for what's to come. At least uh, in the case uh, of, well, basically, it just, um, just going after my dream. Yeah, it's basically been a dream of mine to not only work with music, but also write stories. Yeah, hey, why not incorporate both into uh, my story? I mean, hell, I mean, hell, it'll be a, it'll be a great way to introduce talent. Yeah, I'm not trying to sound arrogant or rude or anything. But honestly, yeah, just some people in this world cannot sing. Like, for example, that, that bleep Azzyland, basically. 
yeah, I mean, dude, I mean, dude, stick to your gaming videos. It's what, it's basically the first thing you were doing on YouTube. Okay, now going back to, who uh, would, okay, now going back to the possibility of, of getting the story arc out. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to get the whole thing out, like, before, like, before Saturday, which sucked. Sucked because I was still writing Chapter 7 at the moment. In fact, I still am doing this as I'm recording this video. Yeah, so, you know what? Screw it. I'll just uh, make this around 11 or 12 minutes in length, then. Since I'm already at the end of the 10-minute mark. <sighs> Alright, so yeah. Basically, I also have of, uh, new followers, and, uh, and people are actually interested in the story I'm, I'm uh, actually working on. I mean, hell, I did show them the origins first. I mean, hey, it's only fair. Uh, yeah. Uh, and hey, at least in October, I can see... I can actually read the... I can actually read a Volume 7 of Flame. Yeah, by the way, it's a damn good story. It's basically Ruby-inspired. And, uh, well, honestly... Well, honestly, if you guys have Wattpad, I totally recommend you check him out. No, no, not in that way. Not in that way. No, I mean, like, check out his content uh, on a Wattpad. It'll really help him out. And, uh, yeah, I want my friend to succeed. Well, um, even if, uh, even if basically uh, both of us are... Pretty much setting ourselves up for failure at the Wadi Award, at the 2019 Wadi Awards. I don't think either of my stories that I submitted will actually win. Unfortunately, I mean, hey, at least it gives me two chances. Huh? I mean, they, they basically didn't say I couldn't do that. Okay, I guess I will conclude this here. Since it's already, since it's already almost past the 12 minute mark. So I guess please be sure to give this a like if you enjoyed it. Comment down below, let me know what you think. Subscribe and click the bell for notifications. It'll really help my dying channel out. And if you won't do that for me, please do that for the cute dog you saw in the previous video today. Yeah. Yeah, if you won't do that for me, then do it for her. Yeah, if you want to see that cute face still. Then, uh, and like, comment, and subscribe. It'll help my dying channel out. And the hell. And help make her famous, pretty much. <sighs> okay, so. So, with that being said, I'm still waiting for questions for the upcoming QA video. So, leave them in the comments down below, like always. And once again, Jacob Gutierrez, if you're watching this, you have my condolences. It's a shame when you lose someone you care about. Yeah, you're not alone. I've lost so many people in my life, and yeah, I just want to let you know that uh, everything will be okay. But I know that sounds pretty cliche, but I want you to know that everything can, in fact, be okay. I mean, hey, at least they're watching over you from uh, heaven, pretty much. And uh, with that being said, have a good day, afternoon, evening, or night, or whatever time you're watching this. If today was not a good day, tomorrow could always be better. And, and uh, take care of yourself and everyone around you, and uh, have a good one, everyone. And I will see you all tomorrow. See you all very soon.